Hi, yeah, welcome everybody to Latif's Inspired. I've just come back from Morocco. I decided to uh, put a vlog off it. So um, enjoy the experience. We visited Marrakesh in Morocco, had a phenomenal time. Uh, fantastic food, fantastic people, love the culture, love the scenery. And I just can't wait till I go back, maybe another city to enjoy a uh, more, exp well, better experience. And I really enjoyed the food. I really wanted to get away, got away, come back. And um, I'm really excited to go back. So me and my brother had a fantastic time. And here it is guys, enjoy. Habibi 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 it's a very nice and friendly people. Thank you very much. Welcome to Morocco. English. English. Yes. Cobra. Big one. Big one. Come here. For sale. I'm scared. No touch, come for film, for show. Right, if you're wondering who this English lad is, um, or the white lad, with us uh, we met him on the bus we didn't have a phone so he he had his phone and uh, he was staying um, near the square where we wanted to stay so he was just gonna show us around um, on his navigation on his phone and um, help us find a hotel beautiful uh, person he was and very helpful so thank you very much mate What is this? I just saw my hair. I just Chicken. 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 Right guys, um, I put my bags away, we booked into a hotel and um, we're having a nose around the local Jamaya Al Fena, the square in Marrakesh. Um, the food stalls, the fruit stalls, um, the drink stalls, um, everything. So we just wanted to get a feel of the town um, and the square obviously. Um, so there's loads of people, uh, very nice and friendly. Obviously everyone's trying to sell everything to you. 
and um, try and just basically just get you into their stores for so you go and eat and stuff and get out their stores um, hustling for cash obviously uh, but generally very nice people no issues no what's uh, problems whatsoever um, good fun good lads they were Yo, these were snail soups, um, not for my liking. Oh, uh, mom, if you're watching this, um, I didn't try it, so don't worry, I was perfectly safe. Right, wanting to try these fresh fruit juices because they look beautiful. Um, this guy offered me a free juice. Um, very nice. But, um, I decided to have an orange juice. Very nice and sweet. What flavour? Right, the fruit juice was gorgeous. Went back to the hotel, had a little sit down rest and feeling hungry. So I came back to the Jamal Al Fena Square looking for the food stall and I'll try it. Well, obviously I stayed safe and I tried a beef tagine um, something simple for the first night uh, before anything adventurous welcome thank you, home thank you welcome habibi habibi so what is that what is that you give me this is tagine beef okay it's original tagine from Bebe. what's your name Mif abdul abdul rahim so where are you based 100 yeah this is number 100 always the hero this is your team, yeah? Yeah, this is my team. Right, welcome everybody to Latif's Inspired. Um, as you, you're not probably aware, but um, I've taken a little mini break just before Christmas. Uh, my brother's actually booked a spontaneous holiday uh, for a few days. So we're in Morocco now. And uh, I came yesterday. It was quite overwhelming. Um, I just did bits and bobs of uh, me coming over here so um, hopefully this will be in the vlog uh, but today I'm going to actually start um, the vlog um, so I'm going to go out what I'm going to be eating and I've, al I've always wanted to come to Morocco uh, for quite a while now so I'm here now going to check it out I'm especially intrigued to try I always see that that big famous square that they have those lamb heads and stuff like that so I'm quite fascinated by it and I just want to see how that tastes so I can't wait really so we woke it up uh, we didn't sleep. Um, obviously, the holiday was on um, Sunday early morning. So I left work, put all the way from Stockholm Trent, went all the way to London uh, after my shift. No sleep. Got on the plane, came over here. No sleep, and we just toured the whole area for the whole day. Just got bl bits and blobs, but I was overwhelmed. Like I said, with the people, they're just in your face. You have to be very careful. If you ask for a little bit of help, they want some money return, and it's just. It's just a bit hectic, but today I kind of got used to it. Obviously, you know, I've been Bangladesh a few times. I know how hostile that can be, but I kind of enjoyed it. So today I'm in a relaxed mood. I slept, went over breakfast time. So it's over 11 o'clock now. We're late for breakfast, but they're going to do us breakfast. And this is one of the brothers who's going to be here. Come here. You want to say hello? Hello. What's your name? Yasin. His name is Yasin. He's, uh, is it your uh, um, hotel, your dad's? So it's his dad's hotel and he's going to be treating us, he's been very nice with us and uh, hopefully going to give us breakfast, yeah? Yeah. Good. Wow, so this is the little breakfast they're very kindly done. I've actually checked the time, okay, it's um, over 12, so we okay. slept. Wow, nice croissants, some nice bread, teas, marmalade, jam, sugar and some boiled eggs. So I think we're gonna scoff away now. So this isn't all by, for me actually, this is for me and my brother. So I've made my little French roll into a sandwich. So I put some soft cheese and a boiled egg with my tea. Right, gonna shoot off to the streets. Check it out now. This is Morocco. And Nice little balcony view, it's where I'm staying. Quite a lot of alleyways in this um, town. This is the square, square name, Kita? Uh, Jama Al Fina. This is the square, the Jama Al Fina. It gets hectic. 
It's always busy. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Yeah. How are you, brother? Alhamdulillah. Wa alaikum as Wa No, 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 Thank you. Assalamu alaikum. Right, we're just walking through the square, checking it out. Saw this beautiful sh ornamental shop. Obviously, these Moroccan arts are beautiful. These copper, gold, silver, brass, it looks beautiful. So this was a fantastic, phenomenal shop that I just had to walk in. Assalamu alaikum. Right, my brother was saw this knife, sword, sorry, and he was fascinated by it, but we weren't allowed to film it. It was beautiful. One of it's like one of these historic, um, um, historic knives from like a Merlin um, film or something. It was beautiful, gorgeous, and the design was amazing. Uh, maybe next time we can get one as an ornament. Oh no. Call to prayer. Right, that was the beautiful call to prayer. It's the midday um, call to prayer, which is the Dohor Adhan. Um, we saw some people obviously going into the local masjid, the mosque, um, to offer their prayer. And um, obviously there's so many mosques in the square. So um, we, we just followed them in and did our prayer. Right, we're walking past this um, restaurant. Thank you. Obviously, Marrakesh is known and is famous for the uh, tanjir, uh, which is the pot of um, lamb. Um, and obviously, these, these lamb is just a whole lamb roasted um, in the oven for slow cook for hours. And it just the meat just looks so juicy, and they gave us samples to try, and we How had to just stop and try. Not now, me. I come after. After, not now. So he's given us a piece of this lamb to taste. Mm. Very nice. So this lamb, is this one in here? Stands here, yes. Is it like with chickpea in here? Or? Chickpeas, yes. Chickpeas. How much is this one? It's 20, 25. 25. So lamb and chickpea inside there. Yeah? It's fish. Sorry? Chickpeas. Yeah. It's lamb. It's half kilo. Half kilo. Half kilo. Half kilo. Oh, half kilo how much? 75. 75. Okay, okay. Thank you very much. One kilo, 150. Okay. Sure. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu Right, I love olives and um, I thought I'll just stop and um, just show you these olive shops. It was beautiful and the colours, I just love olives. Yes, just 
one with the ham, full with olives. Just this one with garlic, with thyme. Hadi kara. Hadi kara. Hadi. Ya, ce ne mai șeagi? Nu știu, dar nu era așa. Să vei grizi. Ai de unde? Ma dar să te iau fără mai șeagi. And those olives were phenomenal. It was a fantastic experience. And obviously can't leave Morocco without looking at um, a spice shop. Beautiful. Those are colors. This is the raw form of turmeric. Beautiful. Habibi, I'm just looking now. Marhaba. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Assalamu alaikum. 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 Right, so I came to the shop, he was saying it was about 10 dirham for these, but it was a mixture which I didn't want. So I told him to make it fresh, so he said 15 dirham. So inshallah it looks fresh and um, I'm going to give it a try, see how it is, because I love pomegranate. It's very healthy, very tasty and he's made it in front of me. This is nice and fresh. Habibi, what's your name? Abdul Tif. Abdul Tif. Abdul Latif, subhanallah. Abdul Latif, me. Abdul If you come to Morocco, meet Abdul Latif. Very it's good. Welcome. Yeah. Same, same. He's very honest and he's maybe 100% pomegranate juice. His name is Abdul Latif as well. So this is the pomegranate juice. It's very nice. It's got a slight bitterness to it because of the rind. But if you want to taste 100% juice, that's what it is. Make sure you speak to them and get it to 100% because they do mixtures and they sell you something that you don't really want, but they think they're selling you something that you want. So please be careful and be very smart whenever you're buying anything from Morocco. Uh, brother, wait, wait. Give, me, give me some time. It's YouTube. Uh, YouTube. This one. This one and this one. Right, these are lovely little shop. Um, they sell sandwiches. Um, they sort of char grill the meats, the sausages, and um, this. Uh, well, this is the tangi, the tagine. Um, beautiful little food stalls everywhere. Gorgeous. Sandwich time. Smells nice. I what is this? This guy just sells fish sandwiches. So just simple fried fish and then just puts it into the bread and then gives him like olives or pickles and sauces. Very nice and friendly last.
Assalamualaikum. Right, we're tired, walking and walking and walking. Found this lovely little um, tea shop. Thought we'll sit down and maybe have a green tea. Right, I'm sitting down, had a fair bit to walk, had loads of views on um, uh, restaurants, sort of street food, dining. Um, so I just want to chill out. My back is kind of hurting. So uh, not been resting for a bit, but yeah, gonna chill out, have a nice mint tea. And then um, gonna we're gonna go and have a nice, fat munch we're looking to have a it's the famous tangier that we were looking for it's basically some it's basically lamb in a lot of in a pot um so cooked. no not tajin but tajin no. but i'll t uh, when i'm eating it then I'll, I'll, I'll vlog it when i'm eating so i can't wait it's having a nice mint tea using like this with some sugars hello no, just clamp on that. Just no. Yeah. Very nice tea. Steaming away with some fresh mint. I'm going to take one sugar. Enjoy now. Too many bees. We finished it. How much is tea? How much? How much? How much? Three, three. Three dirham. Three dirham. Yes. Thank you. A three dirham. How much, brother? Six dirham. Thank you. Spotted a KFC in Morocco. I'm going to quickly show you. Okay, we uh, we're just going back to the square now, and we were going to travel, so we've come and checked out the local bus station, taxis, and um, obviously we just don't want to stick into Marrakesh. Um, we want to have a look at the surrounding areas and stuff. Obviously, it's a cultural tour. We, we haven't taken like um, a, uh, what's my call it, a package deal because I'm not really too keen on that. But um, yeah, this is really exciting. We don't know where we're going tomorrow, but we're definitely going to leave this town and go somewhere. Not too sure yet. The traffic's quite busy here, so I have to watch both sides and um, cross the road. Yeah, I'm getting in my element now. Um, getting used to Morocco and you getting used to all the traffic um, is quite good. Um, a bit crazy, hectic, but it's all good. Now we're, gonna, we're quite hungry, um, it's nearly hitting five o'clock. We're gonna go and get a big fat munch now, so I can't wait. Going into the famous square now, Jamea Al Fina of Marrakesh. It's evening time, um, just hit five o'clock, so I think everyone's left work and coming out to eat and just let their hair down. I'm also letting my hair down because I've taken it off. Yeah. 
Right, we've been walking and walking and walking and um, the lamb dish that we want to try is the very famous um, dish of Marrakesh which is the lamb tangier and it, it's the shop that we went into earlier when we were walking past and they let us try a bit of the lamb um, I kind of know where it is but um, it closes um, early so we're looking for the shop and um, hopefully we can sit down and have our last meal at the lamb leaving the square it's on one of these side roads it's gonna be a bit cheaper and a bit more authentic food so we're quite hungry now um, about 10 minutes past five so we're gonna go and get something to eat um, I can see there's one called the cafe Kasabian but I'm going to nothing nothing um, sort of I want to read something not nice and authentic so that's what I'm gonna go and look for and I'll show you what we're gonna get Show you, show you. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. I don't Stop. 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 Is it now me to run the game to learn? Sorry. It's good. Lamb spices. Very good. Top here, sir. Wow, look at this. So this is lamb cooked for how long? That's lamb. Bismillah. So is this one kg or half kg? It's one kg. One kg. Spices. Man, yeah. Nice. Right, I've got the lamb, it looks very nice. It's a bit quieter now. When I came the day, it was very busy. Um, very hungry now, so I'm gonna give this a try. It's giving us some olives, some pickles. So, it's a big piece of lamb that is. I'll have a smaller piece. It's not much sauce, so I've asked him to get me some harissa. So. Now, this is the harissa. Harissa. Thank you, drop it off her. Let's see if you can Tastes very nice, I can taste the lamb. I'm going to give it a try with the, a bit of the harissa. I'm going to try the olives. It's 
a mixture of olives. Like a garlicky flavor. There's some spices. I'm gonna add the spices to this piece of lamb. Mm. Very nice in taste. Wow, I gotta admit that was probably one of the best lamb dishes I've ever had in my life. The lamb is melting your mouth, so soft and tender, unbelievably gorgeous. He even showed me that oven, it's like an underground, one story underground. He has to use these long, blimmin' um, sticks to put the lamb in and out. It's a massive oven. Amazing experience. Room. How do you get it in and out? Yes. So he uses this big, massive stick. Wow, it's amazing to cook this dish. Beautiful. Oh, so he cooked me this dish, I had it in lamb. It was very nice, he showed yes. me in the oven as well. So what's your name? Mohammed. Mohammed. Uh, what time do you open here? It's, uh, it's closed. Uh, open, open. Good morning. Morning, uh, 11. 11 o'clock. And what time it's, do you close? Uh, night is finished. What time finish? Night. Night. Yes. So now it's um, 6 o'clock. Yes. So you have to come in before 6 o'clock to get this lamb. Thank you very much. Nice meal. After that big fat meal, went back to the hotel, had a rest, and um, back out again at midnight and obviously last meal um, for the end of the night I thought I'd come out and check out the famous Jamaat Al Fena Square um, so I met some really nice people and um, first right. starting off with a cup of tea I'm, ha I'm having this special tea made with ginger yes ginger, cinnamon, kalanga, cardamom all mixed ginger this is a special tea Special of Marrakesh. Yeah. Very strong. Very strong, yes. Very, very strong. strong. And uh, it's nice for cold. Nice for cold. Yes. And how much you sell this for? It's eight. Eight spices. Uh, how much you sell this for? For the tourists? For the tourists uh, for five. pay. Yeah, five. Two, this is two dirham. Two. So they charge about two dirham for this. It's very nice but very spicy, very strong. Very, spicy, very, strong. very strong. Thank you. So this one your shop is called? 17. Number 17, Hassan. Number 17. Chez Hassan. So uh, I'm, I'm enjoying this, something different, but I'm going to enjoy it. So enjoy. thank you very much thank for your time. You. Welcome. So Hassan, what's this? What is this spice one? Spice cake. Spice cake, yeah? Same spice as the tea? All mixed. All mixed. And this one? Same. Same, yeah? This one same? Yes, yes. Different is cooked. I've met a good friend, his name is Mohammed. Mohammed and Abdullah, it's first time. Yeah. We are friends now, yeah. okay? Yeah. You're welcome, there Mr. You Abdullah. It's first time for you here in Morocco? First time in Morocco. How are you finding? I'm finding it very nice, <laughs> like very friendly. Marrakesh? Marrakesh is nice. Beautiful uh, city or crazy city? Yeah. Crazy city. And tomorrow, I think I'm going to go to Casablanca. Casablanca, the it's white good. hub, the white city. Yeah. Good, yeah? She's beautiful good, in the yeah. big... Ah, she can go to the Vatan Sarhaw. Casablanca, good, yeah? She's beautiful. Yeah. She's beautiful. Yeah. The big city of Morocco yeah. is Casablanca. So maybe I go this there. This is from Casablanca for this. So you're from Casablanca, yeah? From good Casablanca. Yeah? Good. What's your name? Mohammed. <laughs> nice to meet everybody there, inshallah. Welcome, my brother. Yeah. This is your country. Yeah. Oh, it's from Bangladesh. Bangladesh. Yes. Right, these guys were very friendly and very talkative. So, um, starting off, um, I thought I'll try one of their famous soups and um, had a tea with it. A mint tea it was beautiful. I love mint tea, fresh mint tea, gorgeous. And then I went back to Mohammed's stall uh, yeah, for I'm back some at number good 44. Food. Thank you. Um, it's about nearly midnight, and I'm feeling a bit hungry. I had a very long day. And uh, Mohammed, you're recommending me? Yes, I recommend the for you today. 
So he's recommending me. I have choice for him today. It's I chef. do not know what I'm having, but I'm going to have a look and I'll show you what the food is. And you're going to show, can I see inside? Yes. And he's going to let me see inside. So I'm going to go and check what he's having today. Mohammed, can you show me please? This is the, sh the, the beef. The oh, sheep head alert, sheep head alert. Um, please don't get scared and screamish. Um, this is one of their um, favorite dishes and um, national dishes kind of I would say to be honest with you after tagine and stuff this is what they're very famous for and um, I remember seeing this as a young kid and just amazed by it here's its beef the shoulder of beef it's cook and boil exactly just boiled and cooked yes, it's boiled this is the sheep's head sheep's head the same cook and it's boiled exactly some people Arabic it's like the eyes me too I like the eyes okay. the eyes the head the yeah. sheep you know, okay. everything is nice. But for you, I don't know, you can try it. The you people are being like it that. So you this tell is me, the eh? chunk from beef. That's the tongue of the this beef. one, yes. Okay. His is the beef, it's from exactly cow. Okay. Yeah. You know, it's, it's the big. Yeah, it's the big. This is the brain. This is the brain from yes. each time. Okay. That's the brain. Okay. That's the brain. This is the brain from sheep's head. This and is this the one? other. This one? This one? Forget that. This is very important. It's not cholesterol. It's zero cholesterol. This is the other, the teeth of the cow. The what? The teeth of the cow. It's give them okay, the breast of the cow. The breast yeah. of the cow. That's the but breast the of the cow, exactly, guys. Exactly. <laughs> you know, he's what? Do you like? Do you like breast? Breast is uh, zero cholesterol. I like it. You like Believe it? Me. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I miss sometimes. You miss sometimes. Yeah. I miss sometimes. Exactly. Okay. This is the tangier, the special one in Marrakech. The tangier. Yeah? This one. The tangier. Okay. It's just meat. It's spicy. It's spicy. It's spicy. Okay. Spicy natural, but no. Here's the tradition Moroccan, exactly. So everyone, my brother Abdullah, if you yes. want to try this from England, I let you. I, I let. I let you recommend me. Yeah. Okay. Number forty-four. Yeah. Yes, brother. Okay. Now I wait. Okay, okay, Mr. Thank you. This is the lamb tajia. This one is? Habibi? This one is? This is mixed. It's mixed. Mix. Little heat, little bit of everything. Huh? Order. Okay, so this one is very nice. I think it's got the, everything in that the lamb head, uh, the tongue, the meat. So I'm going to give this a try. The taste in the food is very nice. It's got a very weird texture to it. But um, I've always wanted to try it, so I'm giving it a go. Give me some green tea as well. Oh yes, uh, what's your name, brother? My name is Tijani. Tijani. Yeah. So you make very nice food, very traditional Moroccan food. Yeah. yeah? So this one is? This is Tijia. Meat lamb. And you cook in here and the fire with Morocco spicy. Oh, okay. Can I in try? the fire. Can I try a little bit of yeah. this? One, yeah, it's cooking in the fire with Morocco spicy. Spicy natural man. Okay. No chili. Okay, no chili. It's in special Marrakesh, just in Marrakesh, all Morocco. Okay. Wow. So he's giving me some um, really authentic Moroccan style food. Um, so I'm quite um, excited. But um, it's very different to what, I'm, what I normally go for. I think this is the tongue. I'm giving this a little go. This is the sheep head. Okay, brother, how are you finding the food Moroccan? The food was very nice. This um, was the what's that tanji? It's named the tanji. This tanji? Yes, the tanji. 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 This one was the best. Um, this one I tried the lamb the sheep's head, head, sheep's head, and the tongue, the tongue, and the beef, and the beef, and the other of cow, and the other of cow, the tits of cow, it's the, the tits. Yeah, the tits of the cow. It's give them milk. You know. So I've had the tits of yes. the cow. The tongue of the, the beef. Cow. The tongue of the cow. Yeah, the beef. Uh, the, the meat from beef. Yeah, and the, the sheep's head. And I had the sheep's head. Yes. All in all, 
um, there was different textures in the tongue, the tits, <laughs> the breast of the cow. That was a bit different, uh, but I did enjoy it. But the best, I had to down it with the tangier. Yes. Uh, that was the flavoursome uh, dish. But they gave me with some bread and some green tea. So thanks for uh, tuning in. Number 44, uh, this is a family run business and they've been very nice to me. And it's really about midnight now. I was quite hungry, I had to come and eat and I really enjoyed it. So make sure you come and visit them. You're welcome, them. my brother, Abdul Latif. Thank Anytime. you very much. <laughs> okay. Abdul Latif, so try what, that. What is this? It's the liver, the liver of beef. Okay. Everyone knows the liver, but she's from the beef. It's okay. cooked and grilled. Okay. okay. Like skewers, she's kebab, exactly. Okay, what's the, the other liver. ones? Here's the aubergine. What, what is this? This is the pepper. Pepper? Yeah. And this it's aubergine. Aubergine? Yes, aubergine. And that's its right skewer. One? That's its liver. And that's its chicken coconut. Okay, that's its skewer okay. from chicken. So if I want this, what do I say? Who do I go to? Which? Yeah, that's what I want to try now. That's what you want to eat now. Next I like time, it next time. No, no, I've eaten now. Next time you can try yeah, that. The next time. Where do I go over here? No, you can just come in my job and bring you everything. Yeah? Okay. Believe me. I'll I'm, see you tomorrow then. Inshallah, Abdullah. You're my brother now. Yeah. So this is nice food, man. Thank you, man. Me and my friend Mohammed have been sitting and eating. And it's my dinner. Yeah, he's eating, and he's eating some really healthy stuff. It's my food. dinner. Yeah. yeah. So since you sat down in there, now there's got loads of people here. So I'm gonna quickly. Yeah. Everything here is lovely, 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 lovely. good. Believe yeah. me. Okay. And I, and I said we come and sit here and we, you get you get more baraka for this place, yeah? Thank you for this is baraka. Yeah? <laughs> it's really nice, everyone's here nice and friendly. I'm gonna show you now. It's all busy now since I've is that sheep's head, yeah? Sheep's head, yeah. So, mashallah, you're very busy at this time as well, eh? Alhamdulillah. It's baraka. So, is it, is, it, is it busy like this all the time? All the time, yeah. Night time as well, yeah? We have the client, you know, we have the best food, the yeah. delicious food. Delicious food, yeah? So, people eat and dash, you find it's very delicious, come yeah. back for another yeah. time. Okay. Yeah, but that's it's bad, it's not come back. Yes, yes. You so, and me is like. Yes. Right, it's late night and the locals are coming in to eat. And guess what they're eating? They're eating the sheep's head in all its glory. That's half of the sheep's head cut in the middle. Oh my God, you have to see this. My mum, she's watching this, she's probably shouting and swearing at me and my auntie, Hobbies. Uh, but yeah, I had to show this. This is unbelievable, beautiful, just this scene of the locals eating. And this is what I came for, just to experience this um, amazing culinary experience. Fantastic, phenomenal, lovely local people. And I just sat with them, had drank tea and just watched them eat. It's absolutely beautiful. Loved it, loved every minute of it. Right, if you've enjoyed this part one, don't forget to join me on part two. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe.